So hi, this is Daniel from Bidan Concepts in the Saint Circular. And this is our B9 creator. Now I'm gonna calibrate the build table. Okay. Calibrate the build table. It's very simple. We need to make this surface. Okay, in fact it's the bottom one. This surface parallel to the bottom of the bat. So for this we untightened these screws, the four screws, okay, and just so that this is free to fall down, make sure that the knobs are tightly, uh, not too tightly, but just tight enough, and that this knob here is tight, okay, and your build table is placed properly then we need to go inside settings okay. build table you can read all this now this is very important. The table will go down to home zero, and it will press against the bottom. Okay. Then. We need to press down all corners to make sure that the table is flat on the bottom of the bat. And then tighten these screws, but now you have to be careful not to touch the table, not to twist the machine because this will unparallelize the two surfaces so while you're tightening those screws make sure that you're not touching anything else and that the pressure and the force you apply doesn't twist the table uh, the, the arm Usually I use my both my hands. One hand is slightly pushing down here in the corner while the other one is tightening the screw. Now I'm holding the camera. So anyway, don't tighten too much because you can tighten it good after you're done. So, now that you're done uh, tightening those screws, you can and make sure you unscrew this knob completely and remove it. And now you can check the tightness against the bottom. And now we're back on the computer. Finish those steps. See? It says it here. Remove the build table thumb screw. This is important. Because if you keep it there, when the arm is going to go up, it's going to pull the table. And there's going to be suction, a lot of suction underneath the table. And that can damage the PDMS surface. So, keep going.
Le pont, elle est longue comme ça. Now, gently slide the table off the bottom surface. Now you can put it back. Now we can check if the screws are tight. There you go.